Alright, just before this video goes and starts, I just want to say a quick thank you to all you guys for helping me get to 10,000 subscribers. And of course, because of this, we're going to be doing a little bit of a giveaway. Me and a bunch of other YouTubers have actually banded together. And we're going to be giving away a maxed out pigment sword. So all you guys got to do to go ahead and enter is in the description below, I'll have a Discord linked. And of course, once you go ahead and join that Discord, there's also a chat room that says like pigment sword giveaway. Just click on that and it'll basically tell you all the different ways that you can go ahead and enter. But nevertheless, let's go ahead and get right into today's video. Yo, what is going on, guys? It is your boy Kenny here today and we are back on Hypixel for some more Minecraft Skyblock. Now, with update Tuesday hopefully being in the works, as of recording this, it's actually Monday. So if this video comes out, you know, after the update comes out and I'm completely wrong, please don't be mad at me. But nevertheless, with update Tuesday coming and look at the collections and click on the diamond, we're going to go and see that the perfect armor is actually coming out really, really soon. And just looking at it, it is actually in the epic category, which is also very, very similar to the emerald armor, which is also in the epic category so i have a feeling that perfect diamond armor is not only going to cost like regular diamonds not only regular enchanted diamonds but it's actually going to cost maybe a combination of enchanted diamond blocks and something else but we're not quite sure what something else is so in today's video i'm going to be basically showing you guys how i'm preparing for perfect diamond armor and how you guys can too so as of right now if we go ahead and look at my collection we look at our crafted minions we can see that my island as of right now has a minion limit of 17 with around 25 more to unlock our 18th so with around 17 minions going right now most of these are like level 5 through level 7 and I think we have a couple level 8s and level 9s but if we go ahead and like look at some of these right now we've got one diamond minion that's level 6 it's got around 17 blocks of diamonds and 7 diamonds now we've been putting enchanted charcoal in these because we don't really have like that many of these solar panels but we do have a couple enchanted blocks of lava like I think if we go ahead and look at this minion right there we've got an enchanted lava bucket which actually increases the speed of the minion for another 25% we've got a budget hopper added on to this and of course the main item that you want to have is a compactor because let's say you're going away for I don't know a week or so or maybe even a couple of days you don't want your diamond minions to be kind of just filled up with diamonds you want it to at least compress all those into some regular diamond blocks so if you go ahead and look this basically has an action every 20 seconds meaning that let's say I have this block empty right here and around 20 seconds it's gonna go ahead and place this and once the entire area has been filled with diamond ores it'll be another 20 seconds and then it'll go ahead and break this so realistically we get a diamond once every 40 seconds meaning that within an hour you're probably gonna get maybe like 60 to 70 diamonds which I think is definitely pretty pretty good and, and keep in mind this is only with a diamond minion level 6. Alright so I just did some quick maths and I actually found out that if I was just go ahead and leave this minion here for around an hour it would generate me around 120 diamonds so basically two stacks of diamonds and if you go ahead and multiply that by around the 17 different minions that we have in one hour we are getting 2040 diamonds so that's around a dub chest of diamonds pretty much every hour and if you go ahead and divide that and to the amount of enchanted diamonds we'll get basically in every hour we'll get around 12.75 enchanted diamonds so while I think that having a bunch of diamond minions kind of working for you while you know you're just kind of like not online is a really good way to make a lot of diamonds I also feel like there's also a better way to go ahead and get some diamonds which is of course getting yourself some money and then going and buying them from the auction house so I've always been a pretty good advocate of like kind of just grinding some money grinding some pumpkins with our pumpkin farm that we have right now we're making around three hundred and fifty thousand dollars an hour and then if you were going to go ahead and go and buy some stuff off of the H, we'd pretty much get ourselves maybe the one enchanted diamond block an hour. Meaning that, of course, if I was to go ahead and mine all of this for literally 24 hours straight, I'd pretty much have enough to go ahead and make a perfect diamond armor set if it only costs enchanted diamond blocks. However, the good thing about also having a pumpkin farm over there or any type of other money making method while having your diamond minions go is that it's pretty obvious that the perfect diamond armor is going to cost a lot of diamonds. However, we don't know if it's going to be like, for example, the aspect of the end which not only cost ender pearls but it also cost blaze powders you're gonna need around a double chest of blaze powder to go ahead and craft an enchanted aspect of the end so hopefully it's not the same thing but in the odd case that the perfect diamond armor actually costs something else other than just diamonds you know the more money that you have in your bank account the more you'll be able to just go to the auction house and then buy those materials that you might be missing but anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, go ahead, drop a like down below, and in the comment section, put down what type of strategies are you guys using to get that perfect diamond armor, and if you guys are going for, like, any type of other armor, I know a lot of people right now are literally fishing to, like, I don't know, they can't fish anymore, and literally they're going for, like, maybe emerald armor or something, so tell me, like, what you guys are going for right now, like, what armor do you guys think will be the best in the near future, but nevertheless, I hope you guys did enjoy this video, if you did, go ahead, drop a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, I'll see you in the next one, peace out.